everybody! Today I'm showing you how to play on the piano Marshmallow and Pritam, the song Biba. I'm going to show you the right hand, the left hand, how to play them together for beginner level, middle and advanced. So come over here and I'll show you first how to play it. This is how you're about to play. This is about 1 minute and uh, uh, 11 seconds to 1 minute 18 seconds of the song, the main hook. with a simple version. So place your left hand on a C, right hand on a G and press together. Hold the left hand on the C, left hand go to E flat, G, F, E flat. Then left hand was, are going to move to D with the right hand to B flat. Then to G, to A flat, the left hand just stays there. G, F, E flat. Let's put it together. G before moving to the third out of four parts left hand A flat right hand G then E flat G F E flat and finally step to the F on the bottom here with the left hand and right hand D E flat F G F E flat so the beginner level is because left hand is just one note so right hand is where your left hand will have two notes. So it's going to be C and E flat with the right hand, sorry, G, C and E flat together in the left hand, right hand, G, E flat, G, F, E flat. Then left hand, we're doing B flat major triad. So you're going to go B flat and D with right hand, B flat together. Once you got that, keep holding your left hand, right hand go G, A flat, G, F over here. Come back to G, and right here, just shift to A flat and C, E flat, G, F, E flat, and finish with the left hand, pressing F and C, and right hand, D. Go up to E flat, to F, to G, to F, and E flat, and here we're going to loop this again. So this version fits on a little hand, like for my student, who is three or four. And the final version is going to be where you press the whole uh, triad in the left hand, which is C, E flat, G. Then you can press the whole B flat triad for the second part, will be B flat, D, F. That's just the left hand. Then you can press A flat, C, E flat for A flat major. And here, if your hand stretches far enough, you can go F, C, and even F on the top, where you can keep it optional. And for the rhythm, you can add any rhythm that you want. together do it fast and slow now together it's gonna go like this together C E flat and G with right hand A flat uh, sorry G like this so right hand G left hand this together first, then left hand will stay here, right hand go E flat, G, F, E flat, and after you press the E flat, right hand hold and left hand press this one more time. So together the beat will be like, and that way it will have a little more rhythmic flow. So after this, press left hand, and then left hand move to B flat, D, F, which is B flat major, and the right hand go to B flat. And now continue G, so like this. So you notice I press my second time left hand after the F, like this. And I'm gonna do it slow. Left hand B flat, D, F, right hand B flat, press, left hand hold, right hand G, A flat, G, F, left hand press it one more time, and right hand G. So now the rhythm is like this. because I told you where to press the left hand second time. Now the third part is going to be
be similar exactly like the first part you just repeat this a flat c e flat after this melody g together with the a flat c e flat in left hand then left hand stay right hand e flat g f e flat and after this e flat you hold it left hand repeat the chord you are pressing and now the last part before the pre last note you pause and press left hand one more time so it's going to be like this um, C, C with the F in the left hand optional tough note and the right hand is D now left hand just stay where you are right hand go E flat F G F and before E flat just quickly press left hand one more time and once you finish these four little parts you start again and you keep looping it which means you keep repeating it in a row